Welcome to our channel. In today's episode, we'll be exploring the fascinating world of elephants in Thailand. We'll discuss their cultural significance, the different species found in the country, and the critical role of elephant conservation. So, let's dive right in. 1. Significance of Elephants in Thailand Elephants have a special place in Thai culture, history, and religion. They are revered as sacred animals and symbols of royal power. Let's take a closer look at their role in Thai mythology, art, and architecture. Elephants have a rich presence in Thai mythology. For example, Erewhon, the three-headed elephant, is associated with the Hindu god Indra and is a symbol of strength, protection, and prosperity. You'll often see Erewhon depicted in sculptures, paintings, and other forms of Thai art. In Buddhism, the white elephant is associated with the birth of Buddha, making it a symbol of purity, wisdom, and spiritual power. Thai temples often feature elephant sculptures and carvings, which are believed to protect the temple and bring good fortune. Elephants have been used in royal ceremonies in Thailand for centuries. Historically, the white elephant was considered a symbol of the monarch's divine right to rule. Today, the royal family still uses elephants in ceremonial events, such as the royal plowing ceremony, which marks the beginning of the rice planting season. Thai art and architecture often feature elephants in various forms. You'll find them in temple murals, wood carvings, and traditional paintings, as well as in modern art pieces. Elephants are also a common motif in traditional Thai textiles, jewelry, and other crafts. The elephant is a powerful national symbol in Thailand, representing strength, wisdom, and resilience. You'll even find the elephant on the Thai emblem, and it has been featured on the country's currency, stamps, and other official items throughout history. As you can see, elephants play a significant role in Thailand's cultural and historical tapestry. Their presence permeates various aspects of Thai life, making them truly special creatures. 2. Elephant Species in Thailand Did you know that there are two species of elephants in Thailand? In this segment, we'll introduce you to the Asian elephant and the critically endangered Borneo pygmy elephant. The Asian elephant is the most commonly found species in Thailand. These elephants are smaller than their African counterparts and have a few distinguishing features, such as smaller ears, a rounded back, and a finger-like appendage at the end of their trunk. Asian elephants are incredibly intelligent and social animals. They live in matriarchal family groups, led by an older, experienced female. These groups consist of females and their offspring, while adult males typically lead a more solitary life, joining the group for mating purposes. The Borneo pygmy elephant is a smaller subspecies of the Asian elephant and is critically endangered. Their natural habitat is limited to the northeastern part of Borneo Island. Though sightings in Thailand are rare, a few small populations might still exist in the wild. Borneo pygmy elephants are known for their gentle and friendly nature. They have distinct features, such as a babyish face, larger ears, and a plumper body compared to other Asian elephants. Due to habitat loss and human interference, their population is declining rapidly, making conservation efforts crucial for their survival. The Asian elephant is listed as endangered on the IUCN Red List, while the Borneo pygmy elephant is classified as critically endangered. The decline in their population is primarily due to habitat loss, human-elephant conflict, and poaching for ivory and other body parts. In Thailand, numerous organizations and sanctuaries are working to protect and conserve these magnificent creatures. 3. Elephant Sanctuaries and Parks Thailand is home to several elephant sanctuaries and parks that focus on conservation, rehabilitation, and ethical treatment. Join us as we visit Elephant Nature Park, Boon Lots Elephant Sanctuary, and the Wildlife Friends Foundation Thailand. Elephant Nature Park, located in Chiang Mai, is one of the most famous sanctuaries in Thailand. Founded by Lek Chalert, also known as the Elephant Whisperer, the park provides a safe haven for rescued elephants, many of whom have faced abuse, neglect, or exploitation. 
At Elephant Nature Park, the elephants are allowed to roam freely, socialize with their herd, and engage in natural behaviors without fear. Visitors have the opportunity to observe and interact with the elephants from a safe distance, learning about their individual stories and the importance of conservation. Boon Lots Elephant Sanctuary, or BLES, is located in Sukhothai Province. Founded by Catherine Connor, BLES is named after a baby elephant named Boon Lot, which means survivor in Thai. The sanctuary is dedicated to creating a natural and peaceful environment for its rescued elephants. BLES focuses on quality over quantity, providing personalized care for each elephant. The sanctuary is also committed to educating visitors about ethical elephant tourism and the challenges faced by elephants in Thailand. The Wildlife Friends Foundation Thailand, or WFFT, is more than just an elephant sanctuary. Located in Pechaburi, this organization rescues and rehabilitates a variety of wildlife, including elephants, primates, and birds. WFFT's Elephant Refuge provides a safe and natural habitat for rescued elephants, many of whom were used in the logging or tourism industries. The organization also works on community-based conservation projects and conducts educational programs to promote the ethical treatment of animals. These sanctuaries and others like them are playing a vital role in protecting and rehabilitating elephants in Thailand. By supporting these organizations and choosing ethical ways to interact with elephants, we can all contribute to the conservation of these incredible creatures. 4. Current Elephant Population The elephant population in Thailand is difficult to estimate. In this section, we'll discuss the challenges of tracking these elusive creatures and share the latest population estimates for both wild and captive elephants. Estimating the exact number of elephants in Thailand is no easy task due to their elusive nature and the dense forests they inhabit. Additionally, the fragmentation of their habitat and the fact that some elephants are captive or used in tourism further complicates the process. Despite the challenges, it is believed that there are around 3,000 to 4,000 wild elephants in Thailand. Conservation efforts, such as protecting and restoring elephant habitats, are crucial to ensuring the survival of these wild populations. The captive elephant population in Thailand is also significant, with an estimated 3,500 elephants living in various camps, sanctuaries, and tourist attractions. Many captive elephants have been rescued from harsh conditions, while others have been bred in captivity. It's important to note that not all captive elephant facilities prioritize the welfare of their elephants. This is why it's crucial to support ethical sanctuaries and parks that focus on rehabilitation, conservation, and the humane treatment of these animals. The Thai government and several organizations are working together to protect and conserve the elephant population in the country. These efforts include anti-poaching patrols, habitat restoration projects, and initiatives to reduce human-elephant conflicts. By supporting these conservation efforts and raising awareness about the importance of protecting elephants, we can help ensure the survival of these majestic creatures for future generations. 5. Main Threats to Elephants Elephants in Thailand face many threats, including habitat loss, human-elephant conflict, and poaching. Learn about the challenges these gentle giants face and what's being done to protect them. One of the primary threats to elephants in Thailand is habitat loss due to deforestation, agricultural expansion, and urbanization. As their habitat shrinks, elephants are forced to venture into human-populated areas in search of food, leading to increased human-elephant conflict. Human-elephant conflicts occur when elephants damage crops, property, or infrastructure while searching for food. In some cases, these conflicts can result in injury or death for both humans and elephants. To mitigate these conflicts, conservation organizations are working with local communities to develop sustainable land use plans, install deterrents, and promote elephant-friendly agricultural practices. Poaching is another significant threat to elephants in Thailand. Elephants are targeted for their ivory tusks, which are highly valued in the illegal wildlife trade. Poachers also hunt elephants for their skin, 
bones, and other body parts, which are used in traditional medicine or as luxury items. To combat poaching, the Thai government has implemented strict anti-poaching laws, and conservation organizations are working to increase patrols and surveillance in elephant habitats. Elephants in Thailand have historically been used in the logging industry, but this practice has been illegal since 1989. However, some elephants are still exploited in illegal logging operations, which can be detrimental to their health and well-being. Additionally, many elephants are used in the tourism industry for rides, shows, and other attractions. These activities can cause physical and psychological stress for the animals, and experts recommend avoiding such practices in favor of ethical elephant tourism. By understanding the challenges faced by elephants in Thailand and supporting conservation efforts, we can help to protect these incredible animals and ensure their survival in the wild. 6. Ethics of Elephant Riding Is riding an elephant ethical? Many experts and animal welfare organizations say no. We'll discuss the reasons why and recommend responsible alternatives for interacting with these amazing animals. Elephant riding has long been a popular tourist activity in Thailand, but there's a dark side to this seemingly harmless practice. To make elephants submissive enough for riding, they often undergo a cruel training process known as fajon or crushing. This process involves breaking the elephant's spirit through physical and psychological abuse, resulting in lifelong trauma. Additionally, the weight of a saddle and passengers can cause long-term damage to an elephant's spine, leading to chronic pain and discomfort. The repetitive nature of the rides and the lack of proper medical care at some facilities can further exacerbate these health issues. As awareness about the ethical issues surrounding elephant riding grows, more and more tourists are choosing to support ethical elephant tourism. These experiences prioritize the welfare of the animals and focus on observation and education rather than exploitative interactions. Ethical elephant sanctuaries, such as Elephant Nature Park and Boon Lots Elephant Sanctuary, allow visitors to observe elephants from a respectful distance, feed them, and learn about their individual stories and the importance of conservation. When selecting an ethical elephant experience, look for sanctuaries or parks that prioritize the animal's well-being, provide a natural habitat, and practice responsible tourism. Avoid facilities that offer elephant rides, shows, or other unnatural activities. Do your research before visiting, read reviews, and make sure the sanctuary or park is transparent about their elephant care practices. Support organizations that work on rehabilitation, conservation, and education as they contribute to the long-term survival of elephants in Thailand. By choosing ethical elephant experiences, we can all play a part in promoting responsible tourism and ensuring the welfare of these magnificent creatures. 7. Supporting Elephant Conservation Efforts Elephant conservation is crucial for the survival of these magnificent animals. In this segment, we'll discuss ways you can support conservation efforts in Thailand and help protect elephants for future generations. One of the best ways to support elephant conservation is by visiting ethical sanctuaries and parks that prioritize the welfare of the animals. By choosing responsible experiences, you're not only contributing to the financial support of these facilities but also promoting ethical tourism practices. Many organizations in Thailand are dedicated to elephant conservation, such as the Thai Elephant Conservation Center, Wildlife Friends Foundation Thailand, and Save Elephant Foundation. By donating to these organizations, you can help fund vital initiatives like anti-poaching patrols, habitat restoration projects, and community outreach programs. Raising awareness about the importance of elephant conservation and the ethical issues surrounding elephant tourism is vital. By sharing information about responsible elephant experiences, you can encourage others to make informed choices and support ethical practices. Supporting businesses and initiatives that prioritize sustainable practices and promote coexistence between elephants and local communities can make a difference. For example, consider purchasing products made by local artisans that incorporate elephant-friendly materials or contribute to elephant conservation efforts. Volunteering at an elephant sanctuary or conservation organization is another way to support their efforts. 
Many sanctuaries offer volunteer programs where you can work alongside staff to care for the elephants and learn about the challenges they face. By taking these steps to support elephant conservation efforts, you can make a positive impact on the lives of these incredible animals and contribute to their survival in the wild. 8. Elephants and Ecosystems Elephants are known as a keystone species, playing a crucial role in maintaining the health and diversity of their ecosystems. In this segment, we'll discuss the ecological importance of elephants and why their conservation is vital for preserving biodiversity. Elephants are often referred to as ecosystem engineers due to their ability to shape the environment around them. As they move through the forest, they create pathways, clear vegetation, and disperse seeds, promoting the growth of diverse plant life and creating habitats for other species. Elephants also play a critical role in maintaining the balance of wooded and grassland areas as they feed on and uproot trees. This helps to prevent the overgrowth of trees and promotes the growth of grasses, which in turn supports the survival of various herbivore species. Elephants are essential seed dispersal agents, consuming a wide variety of fruits and plants. As they travel through their habitat, they disperse seeds in their dung, which provides the seeds with a rich source of nutrients and helps them grow. This seed dispersal process plays a crucial role in maintaining the diversity and health of forest ecosystems. Elephants also have a significant impact on water resources within their habitats. They dig water holes with their tusks, feet, and trunks, which can create essential water sources for other wildlife during periods of drought. These water holes also serve as breeding grounds for various aquatic species, contributing to overall ecosystem biodiversity. The decline of elephant populations due to habitat loss, human-elephant conflict, and poaching not only threatens the survival of these magnificent animals but also has far-reaching consequences for the ecosystems they inhabit. The loss of elephants can lead to a decline in overall biodiversity, as their roles as ecosystem engineers, seed dispersers, and waterhole creators are left unfulfilled. This is why supporting elephant conservation efforts is essential, not just for the elephants themselves but for the countless species that rely on them and the overall health of their ecosystems. We hope you've enjoyed this journey into the world of Thailand's elephants. By supporting ethical elephant tourism and conservation efforts, you can play a part in ensuring the survival and well-being of these amazing animals. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insightful content. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in our next video.